Hey guys! So, it's been a couple days since we've been out in the garden. So, I want to go out there and look to see how my cucumbers and my pumpkins are doing especially. But, of course, still my other stuff as well. Um, because I'm still quarantined. Even though my results were negative, we're still waiting on my sons. So I'm still quarantining myself just in case because if by chance he comes back positive, I'm retesting. Um, and if he comes back positive, I have to stay home from work for an additional 14 days. I am feeling better. Um, I still cough and I still have some congestion, but I feel better. So, but it sucks because I miss my husband. He's been sleeping in another room. He doesn't hug me, he doesn't kiss me, you know, nothing like that because, you know, quarantining, you kind of need to stay away from each other. So, I do miss my husband <laughs> and I can't wait for this to be done. But in the meantime, when I do leave the room, I'm wearing a mask, but um, now I'm outside. So, let's go check on the garden. That was a little tangent, but, you know, let's go check on the garden. Oh. Uh, all right, and I realized that I didn't put the camera um, the horizontal way, and I am sorry. So it's not as gonna not gonna be as good of a video. Um, but you know, here I've got this one's grown bigger. A little pumpkin. Um, I'm sure we got. Plenty, plenty um, growing in here. And yes, it is true we got like male and female flowers in here. So they're not all going to uh, make pumpkins. But let's see. Here's this one. Look how big this one is compared to my hand. I love it. There's one in there starting. There's one over there starting. Let's see, we got one in here. Staring at the blossom just fell off and I just poked myself with the vine. There's that one. Here's one here. They're doing good, guys. They're doing good. And I remember when the pumpkins only took up like the corner here, and now they come out way out here. <laughs> um, and I said that they were encroaching on my corn, but they aren't. Um, not really. It's my cucumbers that are encroaching on my corn. But look how much bigger yeah trying to get under that has grown in two two days a little bigger um i don't know if we've got any other ones growing yet it is hot out here guys here's my peppers This one's growing extra extra well so that's good I still need to weed I don't really see any other cucumber here there, there will be a cucumber coming right there that's a female and look at how this is coming out here attaching to my all right this is still pumpkins so they are encroaching a little bit but I don't see any other cucumbers except for that one but we will get more because there are, are other females now here's my popcorn the tallest one, let's see if I can get in here, comes up the leaf when I straighten it out, comes up to my 
collarbone. So getting pretty tall. And then this is my sweet corn. So sweet corn, popcorn. But yeah, super exciting how well this is doing. And this leaf has shriveled up to nothingness. So we'll just pop that off. But yeah, super cool guys. Got lots going on here in the garden. And I do need to still put, like I said, still need to put my tomatoes out. Maybe tonight, now that I'm feeling better for the most part, I'll come out here when the sun goes down and plant those. So, yeah. Just another peek in and see the progress. And uh, I will talk with you guys later. Bye. Hey, P.S. guys. I've been way back in the house. I um, looked at my marigolds, um, my dainty and my petite, and looked through them for any deadheads. After watching Mrs. Greenthun uh, yesterday talking about deadheading them, which I always used to do with any flowers that I had if I would pull off the dead blooms um, so that they can bloom again. But I always just discarded the blooms. But now I've learned that you can actually harvest seeds from those blooms from those dead blooms. So I did only find one dead head um, from my petite, um, I think it was from my petite, no, I think it was my dainty, either or, surprise. Um, I found one to uh, pull off. So I pulled it off, came up to my room and gently pulled it apart and look at what I got guys. My first harvest of seeds from my one, that's how many I got from that one deadhead. So I'm definitely going to be keeping my eye on any of the blooms that die off so that I can harvest some more. But I could share this, these with people or I can uh, just grow them again for myself. I think I still have some from my original package, but these ones came from the ones that I grew from seed. So these are my seeds. How cool is that, guys? The cat keeps wanting to come in here. But I just wanted to show you that. Now I will go. <laughs> Have a great day, guys.